what's up guys so today I am back with another subscription box review for you guys um, today's box comes from Geek Fuel and it is their June 2015 box and I have to tell you guys this box has some really cool stuff in it and I think a lot of you are going to enjoy it so if any of you are interested in finding out all the cool stuff in this box just keep watching and let's go check it out Okay guys, so here's the box. Um, I have to say the packaging is really nice. It's a really sturdy box, so that's always a plus. So let's open it up. Okay, so the first thing that caught my eye is definitely this red Power Ranger magnet. Um, I don't know about any of you guys, but I used to watch Power Rangers growing up, um, like every morning before school, I always watch them. And Jason was my favorite, if any of you know, he was the first Red Power Ranger, so this will definitely be going on my fridge. Love it. Okay. Um, I think this is really awesome for like a subscription box. There is two books in here. Not one, but two. You get two full size books in this little subscription box, and I think that's a really great deal. Um, however, unfortunately, I'm not much of an avid reader. Don't judge me. Um, and I have never, never read a Michael Crichton book, but I'm really interested to dabble in these a little bit. Could be fun. And by the way, am I the only person on the planet who hasn't seen Jurassic World? I mean, what? So, if any of you guys have seen it, can you guys comment below and let me know what you thought? Like, if I should hurry up and go see it because it's super awesome, or if I should just wait until it's out on Redbox. I don't know. You let me know. Okay. Next. Super win on Steam. Um, I guess this key will come into play somehow. I don't know. Honestly, you guys, this is like a little bit above my geek pay grade. I have never played a game on Steam, but it does say that this is a geek pool exclusive and it's a $10 value, so I feel like that could be a great thing. But um, it just says downloadable game code and teaching, so pretty cool. And next, okay. So this is Geek Pool's monthly magazine, shall we? Oh my gosh. Look at all of these 90s cartoon characters. Can we just admire this, please? Like, back in the day, Animaniacs were my favorite. There was Pinky and the Brain on there. Um, Ren and Stumpy. Love. Real Monsters, I used to watch that with my dad. Seriously, I would make him watch that. Rugrats, I mean, what happened to all this? This is like the highlight of my childhood and I need it back in my life. I feel like they should make cartoons like this. Because the cartoons these days are just not as good. They should bring these back. Let me know if you also agree. Okay, next we have 90s movie hero Geek Fuel Boots. I don't know how I feel about this. It'd be really gross. Oh my god. It does not smell good at all. And it feels really gross. Um, I'll probably just give this to my brother. I won't use it. Um, I mean, it's really cool to look at in the jar, you know, because it's green, and that's my favorite color. You guys know that, right? <laughs> but yeah, I mean, I think guys or boys will like this. I feel like they like gross stuff. Girls, not so much, but it's pretty. Okay, what else? So here's a retro video game magazine. That's cool. Um, oh my gosh. There's a Mortal Kombat bookmark for the Jurassic Park books. Um, I used to be like the 
best Mortal Kombat player in the world, and I'm not even joking you. I could seriously kick anyone's ass. My brother and his friends would always play this, and I would literally beat every single one of them. You think I'm kidding. Like even before I knew all the moves, I would just press every single button to make up my own combos, and it worked. I literally kicked all their asses. I kind of miss those days, like, um, love this. And then there's some little pins. Bonus! So, those are cute little enamel pins. And lastly, there is a t-shirt that comes in the box. However, my t-shirt's not in the box because... I'm gonna model it for you. Duh! I can't get, like, a t-shirt and not model the t-shirt. So, let's go check out my t-shirt. Alright guys, so this is a t-shirt that came in the box. Um, it is Da Vinci's Vitruvian Man, but it has an alien from x files in the center. And then all around it, it says, I want to believe and trust no one in 30 languages. Um, very subtle geeky. I like it. I think it has a nice fit. And you have to look really close to even tell that it's um, an x files t-shirt. But yeah, I really like it. Um, anyway, thank you guys so much for watching another episode of ABT, and I will put down below in the description box a $10 off code for you all for your first school box, and don't forget if you like this video to give it a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe, and I will see you guys next time.